Normally, this kind of part would be manufactured with injection molding. And the problem with injection molding is that you have the molds. And even more so with this part, since it's a mechanism where you have an interior slider and then a spring and all this other stuff, you have to make it in multiple parts. Very often it's two clamshell pieces that sandwich together and then you have the latch in between. So you have to have three molds or a three cavity mold to at least hold those three pieces. But overall, it's just a complex system where you'd be spending somewhere between two and $15,000 to make a simple little plastic part. But then you have to realize that there's also all the downstream costs. You have the assembly of those pieces, the error rate within those pieces, transportation of those pieces, because in order to amortize the cost of the mold, you have to produce hundreds of thousands of them, because again, you have that big old upfront cost. Not to mention the fact that once you commit to the mold, that design is literally set in stone. So producing this with molding creates a lot of complexity if you're in a company or a startup where you want a lot of design flexibility or you're in a company that's evolving quickly and trying to meet the new needs of customers. 